Hi, it's Anthony from Sports Development. Um, today we're going to look at making our own tennis rackets. Okay, uh, really simple. All you need is um, a paper plate, um, some straws or a lollipop stick that you can get if you can get them, or some straws. I'm going to use three, um, so it's super strong. Okay, and I'm going to use some sellotape. Okay, um, before you stick it together, you can create your own design. So on your plate, you can make it look like an actual taste racket, or you can put smiley faces on, or you can put your, your school name, or you can draw a picture of yourself. Anything that you want to can go on the plate first. So if you do that before you sellotape it, that would be easier then, so you don't um, kind of, it'd be easier to draw on and things like that, all right? Um, paper plate goes down, if you get the straws, they are going to go on the back. Uh, make sure you put them not too much into the middle because you need a bit of a gap um, so you can sellotape it across. So if you just go a little bit towards the back end there, all right, they're going to go on. Hold them with one hand. You can push down a little bit. It might pop out a little bit of the plate, but you can pop it back after. Uh, get some sellotape and just stick that across. You might need a couple of pieces just to make sure it's super strong. Okie dokie, and if you are using straws, I just sometimes get a little bit at the end just to tape up the end so that stays together so these don't kind of come apart, all right? Really simple, just tape at the end, and that should be a tennis racket there, okay? I made one earlier, okay, so I did a little bit of a sports development one with some uh, checking and cross lines through and a little bit of some smiley faces. Um, best equipment to use with the paper plates is obviously not a proper tennis, a tennis ball, but using a balloon like this. And feel free to do some little key puppy games or some little hits across to your team or to your, um, whoever looks after you at home or friends and family, okay? And very simply, the paper plate rackets can be used Okay, I'm going to do some games with the balloon that you can practice. Um, all individual, these ones. Okay, um, so have a little watch and I'll show you how you can change them and make them a little bit more difficult and a little bit more easy. Okay, uh, first one just balancing, very simple. Balloon on the paper plate and you've just got to travel around the area. Okay, move in different ways as you can. So you might be walking, you might be jogging, might try some hopping and change the other leg, maybe hopping together. Good little challenges, try and touch the floor without it coming off. And do a little turn. Can you even do the hopscotch? Okay, you can also practice some little hits up. And turn it around. You may even use different parts of your body to you, so you might hit it up to yourself. Give it a little header. Or a little shoulder, give it a knee, maybe even a little woo, kick. Okay, so any little tricks you can hit and try and do. Have a little go. Uh, you're going to try and do some little rallies with a partner. Okay, so very basic. If you're waiting for the balloon, you're going to wait in the ready position, which is feet shoulder width apart and your racket or your paper plate racket in the middle. To hit, you're going to go in an open stance position, which is on the side like this, and you're going to try and hit back to your partner. So if you're waiting, you're going to wait like this, and to hit, you're going to come onto the side. Okay, have a little watch. Okay, try and get your best score, see how many you can get. Another little game is where you're hitting to your partner, but you're going to try and hit it so your partner can't get it. Okay, um, try and be safe with this though, because there might be some things in the house that you don't want to be diving towards. Okay, so the aim of this little game is for your partner not to be able to hit it back. Okay. Oh, good point. Oh, good one. Have a little go.